college football. I've got my wish list prepared, but I'm going to save that because right now we have a... It's a great credit to Jim Levitt what he's done as the D coordinator at Colorado. No doubt. And Coach Mack, of course, gets the lead credit. In that area, but defensively, Coach Levitt's doing an incredible job, as you've mentioned. Their secondary, I think it's the best secondary in the South. Second They've got the most favorable schedule, and they don't play Washington. That's the miss this year. And it's Jordan Villeman getting his first action today. And it's good to see him make a play. You know, the last couple weeks, he's had this weekend a loss to Utah. They're going to continue to build this thing, and it speaks to would you rather build or sustain and the difficulty. He hasn't been in. I mean, this is a guy who's third team. You don't really get any practice reps thrust right into this thing. I think he's been admirable. Receiver, but still, that's a ball. It's a, it's a catch in the first down. McMarion throwing a shot here, taking it all, and Villeman's got it. So they do make a big play. He could play. And clearly they've struggled on the deep ball. That's the first one they've hit that I can even remember seeing on tape, let alone in games. And it's an easy three-step game and press coverage on the outside against Joyner. And Villeman does what the staff has been hoping he would do throughout this season. And I think also to speak to some of the drops, when, you've, when you're a wide out, you've got a different spin on the ball. <laughs> so those are my two one-week Heisman <laughs> watches, all right? Well, McMarion, he's got Bolden running down the near side. Oh, a terrific oh, play. Oh, oh, oh. And they're going to.